Hello, welcome back to my channel. I'm Gabby if you didn't know. Now you know and happy Vlogmas Day 17. already Jesus. <laughs> I 17 again yeah favorite movie um we're having an at-home vlog today for the first time I feel like since like day I don't know like early on we are just that wasn't the plan the plan for today was we were gonna go paddle boarding and do some fun stuff and I don't know if we have a cold front coming through or if it's just like Florida winter, but it's cold, and I just don't even think paddleboarding. It's cool outside. Okay, it's like 60, not even. No, it's not. It's 60s at night. It's, it's like. Not. No, it's not. Alexa, what's the temperature? Right now, it's 79 degrees Fahrenheit. Okay. <laughs> Today, expect a high of 82 degrees. Would you also like the current humidity? So it's not cold, but it's cooler. But we're just gonna hang out at home today. Started the morning off cleaning up the kitchen, did the dishes. I have like little things that will make this a fun vlog, but for the most part, I'm excited to just be home. I do at some point though, really wanna get outside because I don't know the last time I laid out and I feel like I am pale and I don't like it. So these are always the best months to lay out because it's actually enjoyable instead of feeling like you are literally scorching to death. So, I'm assuming probably around like 12, 1 o'clock we'll go do that, but, oh yeah, it shows it's going to be sunny all day. I want an iced coffee real bad, so. Let's do, so make both. You want iced coffee? Yeah. So, about that, do we have enough creamer? It's okay, I don't need it. <laughs> I mean, we might. I can no, try. I promise you, she'll make sure? a video over there. I need to actually, after I get iced coffee, I need to sit down and order groceries because we are missing a lot right now. This pumpkin spice creamer has lasted us questionably long, to be honest. That's something that I need to order today. I think I'm just going to order hazelnut, though. I think I've done too much of the pumpkin spice. I probably should have just had water if I was that thirsty. But it doesn't hit as good. Why? Okay, I need to figure out the setting. I'm gonna do that right now, actually. This has been bothering me. My camera, this camera is a camera that like everyone uses, but the low light quality is absolutely terrible. And I feel like I just don't know how to work it. I'm gonna YouTube a setting real quick and try to figure that out because it has been driving me nuts. Like it's so fuzzy. Why is it like that? Is this any better? I feel like I'm not gonna be able to tell until I edit this video. But I think it is. It seems to be, I hope so. Okay, anyway, it is now like 12 o'clock and I wanna go to the pool. I don't know the last time that I opened my bikini drawer, which is really weird for me, but I feel like I haven't been at the pool, at the beach or anything in a very, very, very long time. And that needs to change because I am pale and I don't like it. And everyone always knows the secret to confidence is a tan, so. That is what we are going to do today. I don't even know what bathing suit I want to wear. Let's see, do we have anything like somewhat festive, somewhat holiday-ish? I know I like barely have red. Sure, oh, it's like glowing on camera. We're gonna wear this one from Black Bell. Let's change. Okay, bathing suit's on, cover up is on. I need a towel. This lame one isn't coming with me. I heard what you said about me. Yeah, you're lame because you're not coming with me. I'm sorry. It's okay. Why is that different, like the frame? Well, mm -hmm. even when I walked by, it was different. What do you mean? I don't know. It was like slower instead of like because capturing. Because I think it's like capturing more light, so I'm hoping the quality's better. Nice. I think that's what we're trying out. Um, okay, cool. You think anyone's going to be there? I'm sorry? You think anyone's going to be there? Uh, Why? Like, do I need AirPods or do you think I can just listen to stuff out loud? No, you can probably listen to stuff out loud. Okay. I mean, it's what? I mean, all those workers are going to be like around that area, but... 
You got it. Okay. Let's go. We are the only one. Well, there was someone just here and they just left. So now we're the only one. Just oiled up. This is what I use when, only when the sun's not strong. If the sun's strong, obviously I use like actual, actual sunscreen. But this is my key to getting tan. More so in the winter. A little bit of oil is a long way as I am slipping everywhere because my hands are so oily. I, I think we're going to go to the beach tomorrow because now as I'm sitting here, I'm like, Hello, this is the best time of the year to like enjoy living in Florida. Why have I not seen the sun in months? So that's changing. So I think we're gonna go to the beach tomorrow. Luckily, so I'll have two days of sun back to back, which sounds absolutely heavenly because this feels so good. I think this is why, you know when I like went through that video and I was like, why do I feel like I'm in a funk? I think it was the vitamin D. It's been lacking because instantly, feel a million times better. I'm so confused, all of a sudden I hear running. This comes out, the other one is swimming. To the other side of the pool. But what, I'm so, wait, where did he go? Oh, he's right there, he's getting out. I thought there was a person sprinting. And then I look over and I see this dinosaur. They're so creepy, but like, they're just, oh no, 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 no. Go the other way, hey, yes. No, go the other way, please. They're like not scary because they're here all the time, but like when he's this close to me, it's kind of scary. Oh, bye. Just going for a little dip. All right, we're an hour down. I didn't even flip over. I just wanted sun straight on my front side today, but I think it's about time to wrap it up, head back inside. Honestly, I'm just getting really hungry and I'm very thirsty and I forgot to pack water, so. Okay, we're back. We got a little bit of tan lines. It was an hour, not too bad. Well, hopefully we go to the beach tomorrow. It'll keep adding to it because I literally, I feel like this is the palest I've been in a very, very long time, like over a year or so probably. But um, I'm super oily, so I'm gonna shower and then I don't really know what we're doing for lunch, but I also got, okay, videos were kind of out of order because pretty sure it was the video you guys saw yesterday was where I was placing the Revolve order, but that video is actually supposed to be day 11, hence why there's no day 11, but it had to get like approved by the brand and it took longer than expected. So it ended up going up, I believe yesterday. So the Revolve order came in today. So I wanna do, I haven't even opened it yet. It's been sitting in a box. I've been waiting to video it, but I wanna do like a little try on haul because I think I picked out some good stuff. And I always, every time I get my Revolve order, I just basically do a try and haul for me and Justin. So might as well do it for you guys too. It is haul time. I never know where to do hauls because I feel like lighting is normally bad anywhere this way. So I always do them facing this way. But I think because of the Christmas lights, hopefully this way will be better, decent. I don't know. I kind of remember what I got, kind of forget. To be honest, half of it. Which is so crazy because like you just It wasn't that it. long ago, I know. Okay. Oh, it's all coming back to me. This is always where I like, I just don't know where to start. Oh, it's hot. Well, I guess, but okay. This first one. So I said this in the video, which I think technically was yesterday, that the premise behind most of these, how do I have water all over me? But most of these options is that we are going to be in New York for New Year's, right after Christmas time, like cute wintery clothes. And then this, I think, is a potential New Year's outfit. Kind of cute, right? Should I try it on? It's actually really nice. But like, do I have a pair of like nice black? Okay. If we're gonna commit, we're gonna commit. So we're gonna do a try and haul. She's cute. Honestly, I think it'd be cuter with a skirt now that I'm looking at it with the pants. It was a nice top though. So nice. Really and I love going all out for New Year's Eve because like, oh. when am I wearing sparkles any other time of the year? Literally never. So it's like a fun little dress up occasion and I'm fully covered so I can wear this while being cold. Yeah, I don't think I'd wear it with these pants though. I think either, I mean, I think a skirt would be cuter or maybe I don't know, I almost feel like this needs like dress pants. 
and I don't think I own those, so that's not really gonna help. I do have a black skirt. I don't know, we'll figure out our New Year's outfit. I plan to do another video of like putting outfits together, packing, all of that for when I go to New York. So I guess we'll have to finalize it then, but this is a win right away. I'm very happy with this one. Then I guess we'll just keep this on. I did it. I committed to the leather jacket. I don't know. I just, this is what I said when I was ordering it. I feel like I'm not, I don't know. I feel like you can pull anything off if you just like commit to it. But for some reason in my head, I feel like I can't pull a leather jacket off. But I feel like I would get a lot of wear out of it because, I don't know, I'm always cold everywhere I go. And I feel like I end up not wearing, like I'll go for a less cute outfit just to be warm than to be able to just throw a jacket over top. What do we think? Oh, it's so hardcore. I feel like I'm just not. What do you think? Actually, you like it? I love it. It has like fun, fun details to it. It's very asymmetrical up here. And then I think this is supposed to go around the front, but it's just kind of there right now. What do we think? Probably gonna take some getting used to, but I feel like I can put, I could put some cute outfits together with it. Okay, we'll go to this. I ended up adding a red dress, which I, red is for some reason like the one color that I just, don't ever gravitate towards but we're spending christmas in florida so i figure this could be a cute little christmas dress we're gonna see how it fits i think i like it it's like super fitted up here and then it goes kind of baggy here which i don't understand why or i don't remember it looking like that like i think it was supposed to be tight fitted all the way around but it does the job I think it's cute for a little Christmas dress. Yeah, you like it? It's cute, right? I mean, it like definitely gives you a nice little shape at least. I don't, maybe that's what it's supposed to do. I like the illusion of it. Is that why it's kind of bigger here? Or maybe I just don't have this shape so it doesn't fit me right, but so cute. What is next? What is, I don't even, I literally somehow forgot everything that I ordered. Oh, you like this one. You picked this one out. This is just, I feel like I don't really need to try this on, but it's like a turtleneck long sleeve and it had a little cutout here, which just kind of like adds a little fun detail, but I figured I'd probably wear this like under a coat in New York and it'd be cute. It feels like really nice, like warm quality. So that is that. Okay, this one is in a whole garment bag. I have a feeling this is the vest. Yes, it is. And, okay, see, now I'm definitely gonna have to try something else on under it though, because the vest over the red dress is not going to give it the full effect. I was so excited about this, and then Justin was like, eh, he didn't really love it. So now, I got the vest. I need to try something. Super Power Ranger vibes. I think it, like, okay. I think it's Picture nice. Picture this. I just do not like the like shoulder pad like because it goes out i need to we're gonna try it on i need to find a shirt to put under it and put like a long put that black moth neck shirt on Why not? that one the one that i just had out yeah. okay so here's my vision also here's the last shirt because i did end up putting it on it's super cute um this is what i'm going very pinteresty vibes very like not probably practical but like looks really cute in a photo but if i can get it unzipped it's such a cool, like, it is, ah, it's not showing up on camera. It's almost like iridescent all the way down. Kind of like giving me holographic-y kind of material. But, okay, it does have the wide shoulders still. But I think. I love how different it is. For it's sure. cute. It's and, okay, really, really I'm going to go, really well. I don't have my white, I think I need to actually order a pair of white. No, did I bring them home? 
outfit inspo. I think I need to get more of a, I mean the black doesn't look bad because it kind of makes a white pop, but I think a gray underneath would look better. But I'm gonna show you, this is like the, the very Pinteresty outfit kind of vibes. Are there white ones? Perfect. Okay, so I don't know what my hair would be, but we got the earmuffs, okay? And then this I think is what's gonna pull it all together. The Dior glasses. Now, am I actually gonna need sunglasses? I mean, honestly, the snow sometimes is reflective. See, this looks so good. Like, that's so cute. Yeah. This would be on your Pinterest, for sure. Like, in the snow, does it not, this to this was the idea. This looks good. Looks good, yeah. It looks so good. These earmuffs are awesome. I can't hear anything. It's so cute. I have no idea. Here comes the issue of I have no shoes. I don't know what shoes I'm bringing. My mom's bringing my docks down, so that's literally like my only boot. Wait. Converse? Okay, that'd be cute actually. And I wouldn't mind getting those like in snow or anything. This is cute. Okay, I'm happy with that because I was really stressed because this was, the vest was expensive. It was like a huge chunk of like my limit of what I could get. I think I wore that too. But it, yeah, you wanna come try it on? Mm -hmm. <laughs> but I had a feeling it was gonna pull together and I'm so happy. This turtleneck is a little itchy, not gonna lie. But it's also just might just be my necklace under it. Okay, that was a huge win. Um, I may have to wear this on the plane, because if not, I think it might take out my whole suitcase. But that is a problem for next week. Definitely not for any time current Gabby needs to worry about. Okay, we're gonna try these next two on together. I forgot I did end up getting, honestly, they kind of match. I did not plan to put them together. But I forgot I ended up getting a pair of pants because I had only tops in my cart originally. But these are these super fun, shiny. We decided we liked them better not as joggers, correct? What? These ones, right? But like not as joggers, we like them loose at the bottom? It's like a champagne. I was just gonna say, it really is like the epitome of a champagne color. They're super like reflective. Okay, so that I'm gonna try on with this sweater, which I got this sweater to wear tomorrow actually, which means you might have to open up a Christmas present tonight. Cause I wanna wear, Cloud has a gray knitted sweater. He has a Christmas present that's gonna work. And then I wanted to get a sweater for our like Christmas family pics that we plan to take tomorrow at the beach. But I didn't know if I wanted to wear one I already had or if I wanted to get a new one. So the plan was to wear this one. It looks cute. I love this. I would not wear them together, but I definitely think this is a sweater or the sweater I'm gonna wear tomorrow because the front is all cute, but look at the back. I would have probably Justin tied the bow so that it lays nicer, but it's all open back. I think it's so cute. Pants, also a big fan. Wouldn't wear it with this, like I said. But fun little color. I love that the bottom is adjustable and you can make it either jogger fit or like normal loose fit pants. I think these are really fun. Okay, last but not least. I don't know if I wanna really get out. I don't think I'm gonna get out the tights to wear with this because that'll be more in the, probably the putting outfits together and packing part of the video, but. You guys know I was on the hunt for a good sweater dress. I had like three in my cart and we ended up just deciding on the black one. I like the fit of it the best because it was super oversized. Yeah, this is nice. So I'm gonna try this one on. This will be the last thing. I think this is gonna work like perfect. It's a, I feel like it's like such a good length where it's not like super oversized. Like if I lift up my arms, I don't have pants on right now and I am a little nervous about that. But I think that's giving like the perfect vibe of when I have the tights on. I do feel like I'm gonna need to bring a pop of color in somewhere. And I have no idea where. I feel like I can't really wear, like one of the outfits I saw had a, a collared shirt on under. I mean, maybe I could try it. I just feel like this neckline probably wouldn't. It's like too much of a V to go with that. You know what I did want? That could work. Maybe like a scarf. 
I don't own any, so I really need to order one. But that could maybe be cute with this. Like a white, mm. Let me know down below. Luckily, this is going up. See, that's the best thing about Vlogmas, is you guys can actually help me out. So, the vision is this, and then I guess I'll go show you the tights that I'm thinking. But, I don't wanna put them on. Is that, okay, there we go. So, it has like the Gucci logo all the way down, and they look so cute. Wait till it's done. With like, the, I think this will be a really cute outfit, but we'll try it on later. I could also potentially do leg warmers or like kind of a thing. See, here's my issue is I also don't have a good pair of shoes for this. Like my Doc Martens wouldn't be bad, but it's not like a chunky wintery boot. So we have a few more days to figure that out. I'm not, I'm trying like not to buy more considering I don't have winter here. So like I really would not get much use out of them, but I want this outfit to look cute. That is everything from my Revolve haul. Everything is always, my Revolve favorites are always linked down below. And all of this is in my Revolve favorites. This is really comfy. I love earmuffs. I'm so glad these are like a cute new accessory now. I have them in multiple colors and I just, yeah, I don't know. I don't know why I have them on right now. They're just really comfy. Okay. It is now 3.02. He has to be at the gym at 4. And then I think when he's gone, I'm going to finish wrapping his presents. I also have this massive thing now, Ugh. which is for Cloud. But I feel like I don't want him to see it. I might have to like, which I'm going to feel so bad about. But either I'm going to have to go in another room or I'm going to have to shut him in another room and wrap it without him seeing it. So precious. Okay, anyway. So I added many more presents under the tree. And I I think gift wrapping is almost more of my love language than gift giving is because I just get so much enjoyment out of it. And I love making them look so cute and just like extra because I'm extra. So we have technically, what do I have? Three more of Justin's that I don't think, we're down to like, I have to leave for the gym in basically an hour. So we don't have that much time. And I was trying to like see what else I could get done, but I just don't think I have enough time for anything. So I think we're just gonna have to use today to gift wrap as many as we can. I think we can get three done. I really wanna get clouds done because this box is huge. And like, okay, is it gonna make a difference if he sees the bed today and then I wrap it and then Probably not. He's a dog. But like in my head, I'm like, I want it to be a surprise. And I want to just wrap the bed kind of like very loosely so that when we do our Christmas, he can kind of open it. And it's like he gets a surprise too. Will it make a difference? I just think if I open it right now, he'll literally lay in it already. And then, then he'll get sad when I take it away. So like, do I just go in the bedroom real quick and do that? I'm gonna feel so bad leaving him out here, but I think it needs to be done. Also, I'm a little bit nervous to go in because all the wrapping paper is in Justin's room, but all my presents are in there and I love a good surprise. I'm not, I don't wanna go looking, I don't wanna ruin anything, but like I really hope he put everything like away away so that I don't see anything. This is one way heavier than I expected, but this is for his bed in here because lately he goes through phases of where he likes to sleep. So sometimes he'll like come and lay with us in bed, but he never stays in our bed all night because he just likes to be comfy. And the second we move around, if we like make him uncomfortable for two seconds, he's over it and jumps down. So he lately has been, every morning we wake up, he's been in his little bed that's right next to our bed. And it's just like dingy, it's kind of small. And he deserved an upgrade. So that is his main Christmas present this year. And I'm very excited about it. It looked really, really, really nice online. I went for a slightly bigger size than I think he needs. It's massive. Oh my God. Do I look too big? I don't think so. This is awesome. It's huge. Is it too big? like it'll be fine for him I think it'll I'm 
more so worried about will it fit right there. Like, this thing is tiny and he fits in this. But now this thing is massive. I don't want to take it like all the way out of the wrapping, but I kind of want to see it. This is so big. Does it look crazy over here? It fits. Look at the size comparison. I hope he'll actually crawl into that. We're keeping it. He deserves it. Oh, well that's great. Perfect. <laughs> Guess I didn't think this through. I gave up. I kept it in the box. Word, that's the best we can do. There was no way that thing was getting wrapped. It was ginormous. Hi. So we're just gonna wrap Justin's, which I have three here. I think there's one more coming in the mail. Um, but for the most part, they're all here. I He went to the mall yesterday by himself to try to shop for me, so I have no idea what I, I think I know, oh, dude, hi. I think I know one thing I'm getting, and that's only because he had to show me, because he wanted my opinion on like choosing between two things. Hi, you come over here. You're in the middle of the frame. So I think almost all of mine will be here Sunday, he said. So that is going to be our Christmas day Sunday. I've made dinner plans for us and yeah, that'll be a, it's a whole separate video, but that's where I'm gonna show everything that I got him. I just don't trust some of y'all that get to see him in the gym and I don't want these surprises wasted. So I'm going to, I think I will this, let's fit on this one, come on. Ooh, uh, definitely not. No, I don't want to have to open the whole new roll just for, dude, you are a camera hog. Look at how good they all look. All the way back to here. Not really sure where Justin's gonna put his presents, but that's a problem. He can figure out because at least I was ahead of the game. Got them all done, but now I took up all the room. So I have, that didn't take as long as I thought it was going to, luckily. So it is 5.10. I have about 10 minutes until I have to get ready for the gym. So I'm just going to like chillax for 10 minutes. And then I probably won't vlog at the gym. I'll probably just wait until, I feel like there's been a lot of cheer videos. And I don't even know what we're doing at practice. So I feel like there's not going to be much to vlog anyway. I will probably just see you. When I get home later tonight, it's my night to cook dinner, so we'll cook together. We've done that a lot this Vlogmas, which I feel like is new compared to other Vlogmases. But I've been on my housewife era lately, and I love cooking. Cleaning, on the other hand, not so much. Cooking, down for. Made it home from practice, just got off the phone with my mom and Lexi. Had to stop and get more of this sauce. Guys, we were obsessed with it, but... I've never had to go get like the sauce ever. And I don't really think I've ever actually placed an order at that food truck like directly face to face. I always get it for like delivery or something like that. So I get there, Justin's like prepping me. He's like, you can do it. The lady there speaks English. Like it's just, you just say you want a jar of this, blah, blah, blah. I get to the window. I say, hi, can I have a jar of like the liquid Toro sauce? Speaks only Spanish. Replies back to me in Spanish and I sit there and I'm like, Jar. I like I feel so dumb when that happens and I hate it. I'm like jar of And then we, we made it through I got the right one, but I'm so stressed out I already like hate being social. So when things don't work out like that. I'm like I panic but We're good to go. Um, we we're making homemade chipotle again tonight I already made a whole video basically about this so I'm not gonna give you every little detail But it's already 909 Justin gets out at 930 and I have to completely homemade the pico so i'm gonna put a youtube video on cut up all the tomato cilantro onion open the can of uh corn mix that all together rice is already starting to go now and then i just have to pre prep the chicken and then mix it all together and you know that it's the best of both worlds i meant to take you through the process of assembling it all and then i got too excited and started doing it anyway so we got i'm not even caring about presentation today i'm hungry and uh, lately this has been happening with all the packages that are resealable, the like tear apart line has been faulty. I just don't think that's the case. I just think you've been Oh, wrong. you think it's my fault? Yep. Like I can't even get 
I'm gonna let you figure it out and I'm gonna go get some avocado. This is beautiful. Hard the to mix because it is so full. We're gonna go watch Wednesday, see what the hype's all about. I never really, did you ever watch like Adam's Family growing up? I feel like it was kind of the generation before us. Like I know my mom was super into it. And like, I know about it, but I really don't know the storyline at all, so. I have no idea either, honestly, so. We're I'm kind of excited. Yeah, but I mean, it like blew off the charge. Supposedly it's phenomenal, so. It's so good. Yeah, I'm gonna go sit and eat all this. Dinner was so good. That sauce was 10 out of 10 on the bowl. I am a zombie. I was so tired. I mean, it, lately, and I want to blame it on the time change, like as soon as we set the clocks back or whatever happened, I have just been like so, so, so tired so early on in the night. And I don't know if it's because it's getting darker or what, but I am over it and I'm so tired. So I'm gonna go to bed. I don't really think I have anything else to say today. So, hope you enjoyed. Give us a big like, comment down below, subscribe to your post notifications on, all that. And I'll see you in the next video.